guys, this is Amy Lee 33 and welcome to another episode inside of Amy Lee's Land of Love. Did everyone have a lovely Christmas? Tell me all about it in the comments below. I'd love to hear all about your lovely Christmas stories and I can see there seems to be some homage in the background. Can you see those big green arms? There's a googly in my house. What even? How did you even get here? Googly, I saw you. I wasn't imagining in there. I'm sure there was a googly. I saw arms and everything. Googly? Googly? There is a googly. Ah, the googly is coming. Bert! Bertha, I need you. Bert! Bert, come. Come, Bert. There's a googly. You're going to love to, like, see him. Bert loves googlies. He can't even. Where are my iron golems? Bert, Bertha, where are you? There's a googly afoot. There's a googly in my house. Bert... Bertha? Oh! Okay. <laughs> Hi, guys! Have you spotted him? You're, like, staring him out through the ceiling. Well, you know what, guys? If I let him out, you could, like, go and get him for me, because I know that you love to protect me. They feel safe and they feel good when they're protecting me. Okay, I'm going to let this googly out. And, googly, you can come and meet Bert and Bertha. You're going to love them, googly. Where is he? Oh, he's coming! Ah! Red, red, red. Come on, Googly. Come on, sir. Come this way. That's it. I've got my little friends who want to meet you. Bert! Bert! Hurry, Bert! Bert! Ah! Scared! Ah! Ah! I know I could probably kill him, but I know my golems are loving it. There he goes. Look at Bert. He's like, yeah, and Bertha! <laughs> Rock on, Bertha. You're amazing. How are you doing, my darling? You're looking so beautiful, I cannot even. And Bert, I know you didn't get to kill that Googly, but I'm sure there will be others for you to get next time. Loves it. Anyway, let's go get ourselves a doggy and see all the kitties and see all the other golems and everything like that too. Uh, hello, my little crew. How are you all doing today? Why is there a floating potato on the bed? What even? Romeo, did you bring a potato in the bed? Why is there a potato in the bed? I There are no words to describe my confusion right now. And it's vanished. Did I pick it up or did it just vamoose? I don't even know. But anyway, hello my lovely crew, how is everyone today? Saturn, you're looking gorgeous. Comet in the back there. You know what, sometimes I think Comet wishes that she was a dog. I do, there's like, there's, a, there's little things coming up that is just making me think Comet would love to be a dog. Anyway, phew, breathe Amy, breathe. I'm just so excited, I'm so excited. I had such a wonderful Christmas and I just can't wait to hear all about yours too. But yeah, we really need to get on our way. So, are you all ready for your breakfast my darlings? Who would like some rotten flesh? No, don't make your head go cute for rotten flesh. It's not cute. It's gross. It's grossness. No, baked potato, anyone? I think Romeo loves baked potato, so you can have one. Now, who would like a fishy? A fishy for Saturn? Saturn, would you like a fishy? There you go, Saturn. Have a fishy. Your little green eyes are so pretty, miss. And Comet, would you like fishy too? I'm sure. I'm... Actually, no, I think Comet would prefer steak. But here you go, Comet. Have some fishy. Do you love it? I cannot even. Anyway, who would like some steak after all? <gasps> I tricked you. Did you see that? I skipped ahead. Would you like a lovely jubbly? Steak? Oh, the little heads are so cute. I just cannot even. There you go, Romeo. Have some steak. Little Lola. Lexi, we have Luna. Luna and Lola always kind of get confused. Their names are so similar. And Boomer, we have little red Mars right there. And if we go down here, we have little Maximus and we have Sailor. Now, is that everyone? It feels like I'm missing somebody. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight doggies. Criminy. No wonder I'm going crazy. Anyway, who would like to come with me on today's adventure? Should we play our little game? Uh, what can we call it? You know what you guys have been like saying in the comments like what we should call it and I really like the name like Twitchy like Dog Twitchy or something like that. Let's call it Let's call the game Twitchy Dog. So whatever like whatever dog twitches the first will be the doggy I take with me on today's adventure. So if you haven't seen this game before, it's a very simple game. Uh, I basically turn around for like three or four seconds and the first doggy to twitch will be the doggy who comes with me on the adventure. So I like to involve you viewers as much as possible. Write down in the comments right now who you think it's going to be today. I think it's going to be Max. I do. There's, a, there's there's something telling me it could be this little Maximus. So who do you guys think? Write it on the comments right now. You've got a few seconds. Three, two, one. Right, I'm going to turn around. I need to make sure I can see everyone. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I can see everyone perfect. So I think it's Max. Who do you guys think it's going to be? In three, two, one. Which is the twitchy dog? Twitchy. Anyone twitchy? Who's going to twitch? No, oh! Did you see that? You should 
go check it out. I'm pretty sure that he made the slightest little nose movement. It was so cute. I cannot quite even. Loves it. Come along then, Max. Come along. Let's go see the snow golems as well. Hello, little snow golems. Ah, oh, Mittens, you've got your normal face back. Ah, oh. in the last episode, which was the Christmas episode, he had a gift head. It was rather amusing. Ah, oh, in your head. You've got that weird, like, scary face. Look it. Look. Ooh, ooh. Where are you, Mittens? Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Show them your scary face, Mittens. Show them your scary face. I want to see. He's not showing me anymore. <laughs> Mr. Frost and Blizzard, you're all looking spiffingly. Mittens, are you okay? Mittens, I wasn't laughing at your funny face. I was just wanting to show the viewers in case they haven't seen it before. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to hurt your feelings, Mittens. Okay, you can come out. Just don't cause too much mischief, okay? I spent so long cleaning up and, you know, yeah. What, it, what is the point, really? Seriously. Anyway, in the last episode, it was our Christmas special and it was so much super fun. If you didn't catch it, have a look above my head right now. There's going to be a pink puffy cloud with a link taking you to that episode. We met Santa and he left behind Santa's magic boots. And they let you fly in everything. It was awesome. So what we're going to do, we're going to save these boots and put them in a safe place. And the next Christmas that comes along next year, we're going to travel to the North Pole and we're going to find Santa and give them back to him in time for Christmas. So I'm going to get myself a little item frame up here item frame and i'm gonna put these little santa's boots in my room so they're nice and safe and of course i'm not gonna use them anymore i mean they're not my boots are they i can't use santa's flying magical amazing fabulous boots of course not that wouldn't be cool so i'm gonna put them up here there we go loves it ah santa's magic boots so we will get them back to him as soon as we can or for christmas next year i kind of hi mittens <laughs> do you like santa's magic boots he's like i love them you can't wear them though i know that face mittens you can't take them because they're not ours okay they belong to santa mittens please don't take them that mischievous little face i can never trust that little face Oh, do you remember Jack, my little Mike McCube that jumped through the portal? He was a legend. And these were, of course, my Christmas gifts from the year before. Loves it. Anyway, let's get on with today's adventure. I have something cool planned that I really want to do that I've been wanting to do for some time. So the first thing we do need to do is say hello to Grandfather Oak, who is looking like a spiffing old chap. Isn't he looking marvellous? Every time I see Grandfather Oak, I want to speak like an old English person. You know when they come up with the, like, old chap and how's it going, old bean? In fact, they don't say how's it going, do they? They're like, how do you do, old bean? What is old bean, really? I love it. But yeah, he is an old bean, an old chap. Love set. Let's go down to the cute recruit patch to see which cutie we have added today. I wonder who it could be. Could it be you? It so could be you. Who knows? It could be anybody. It's got to be someone in the world, right? Love set. The cutie I'm adding this week is Ocean Girl 10. I'm adding Ocean Girl 10 because she sent me this amazing picture of Saturn, my little black and white kitty cat. And I thought that was awesome because I don't actually get a lot of fan mail for Saturn or comets. Usually all the guys and all the dogs and even Grandfather Oak and Peace Pig get so much fan mail. But my kitty cats don't seem to get all that much yet. So I was really happy to see a beautiful picture of Saturn. Check out the end of this video for that picture. And thank you, Ocean Girl. You are awesome. Welcome to the cute recruits. I love you. I just can't even. Anyway, so today I want to extend my family just a little bit. Like, I haven't got enough family members already. And I thought it'd be pretty cool if we go ahead and tame our ponies. Yeah, and get ourselves a baby pony. And you guys gave me some really good tips that if I mine, if I mine, if I mine, I'm not mining, but if I get some carrots and turn them into golden carrots, then I can basically breed my ponies. So that's what we're going to do today. And while we're doing that, I'm going to just like fix up this farm a little bit because I haven't like, you know, like, what's the word? I haven't, not plowed it, like harvest. <laughs> that's the word, Amy. That's the word. I haven't harvested the crops in here for so long because... I just haven't even. So, I love, love, love doing this. It just makes me go crazy. Look, check it. Whee! That is so much fun. It's like, I find it way more enjoyable than it probably is. But I just like doing this. It's like, whee! Loves it so much. Can't even on the wheat. Amy likes to harvest wheat. It gives her a happy inside. Loves it. Simple things. Simple things, children. Simple things. So, let's go ahead and replant our wheat. There we go. Ah, uh, there's, there's something, like, so satisfying about doing this. 
I don't know what it is. Do you guys have that? Like, I take great pride in my Minecraft farms. I really do. They're never messy. They're always organized and beautiful and luscious and stuff. I don't know why. It's just a thing I have. I just like to make it cute and pretty and lovely. There we go. Isn't that perfect? Look here. Ah. Oh, ah. Oh. Okay, I really need to stop getting excited about that. Let me just carry on with this little wee bit. Is it sleepy time? Oh my goodness, it really almost is. Ah. 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 Where's Max? Max? I can hear you, buddy. I just can't see you. Right, let's get some carrots. Um, because it's night time. We really probably should sleep real soon because you know, you know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna perish and it's gonna be awful. But let's get these carrots and get those potatoes. Um, and oh, we must well just do the whole farm. You know, like while I'm here. La 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 la. Right, let's plant the rest of these carrots. Like sure. Uh, I can hear Max. I hope he's okay. Max, I would rather you come in, my little buddy. I would like it if you came in the farm so I can keep an eyeball on you and make sure you're safe and stuff. Um, loves it. Okay. Nearly done. Nearly got this. Nearly got this. I like that in here, like, things float in the river. Look, there's a carrot in there. Wee, let's get it. Loves it. Okay. Um, la 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 This is awesome. Look at that. Coolio. Coolie, coolie, coolie. Okay, right, if we get this little bit and pick up the little dregs of carrots that are floating about in the river down here. Ah, awesome. Right, so if we get these potatoes, and then all we need to do is get the pumpkins and the melons, and then we've got enough crops to see us for another... It's like we're harvesting for the winter, isn't it? Oh, careful, Max. Thank you for coming in, but I really don't want to punch you in the face. That would give me a sadness inside. And I'm having a happy because I'm harvesting. I can't afford to have a sadness. Uh, do I get any poisonous? I've never done anything with the poisonous ones. Like, isn't it like you make a potion out of them or something? Right, let me just let me just pop you over here, my little darling doggy. You say that. There you go. There. Ah, now you're nice and safe. Okay, loves it, 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 loves it. Okay, cool, yeah. And then we do this little middle row. Ah, this is so much fun. I could harvest and farm all day long. I don't even know why I am saying that, but I really would. I love the harvesting. The harvesting gives me happinesses. Right, so if we get um, some more there. Romeo loves the potatoes. And I think there's probably like floaty food in here. Look at <laughs> how appetizing. Soggy potatoes and soggy carrots just like chilling out in this little river here. Marvellous. Isn't that just wonderful? Look at Ah, it's like going fishing for potatoes. Okay. There's probably some in the side too. I, I can't quite leave them. Like now I know they're in the river and they're floating and they're getting soggy and stuff. I kind of need to pick them up. Loves it. Right. So if we just go ahead. Oh no. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Silly Amy Gooseberry. Right. Let's just replant these seeds because I just ruined. I just ruined my pumpkins. Right. Uh, let's go. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Loves it. Right. So now if we get our axe, it's probably one of the best tools for pumpkin in. Is that a word? Pumpkin in. I'm pumpkin in. I'm <gasps> Sir. Why, hello there. No, I don't want to buy any cookies. You have the mint chocolate chip cookies. The mint chocolate chip cookies. I want some. Let me have the mint chocolate chip. He's got no mint chocolate chip. It was all a lie. A bad lie. Back away, sir. Back away. Get out of here. He said he had mint chocolate chip Christmas cookies. He was lying. Right, so let's get these pumpkins. Love, 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 love. This is a good harvest. This is a good haul, man. This is awesome. Love, 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 love. This takes a little time, actually. I did not realise. You know what I really want to do, and I'm going to put it on my board at some point, is I want to make a big scarecrow for my world. I don't really need a scarecrow because there's no crows to scare, but I want one, and I'm going to make one. Like a big, like, hay field. Like a, like a corn field. <gasps> we should make, like, a corn maze and have, like, scarecrows in it. Is that creepy? Would people be scared of that? I don't know, maybe. I, I probably could be scared. Right, so let's get our little melons, and then we have harvested enough for the winter. We're not going to starve. Oh my, is this going to take this long? <laughs> we could be here for the next 291 years. I wonder what the world would be like in 291 years. Do you reckon we'll be flying cars by then? Or like hoverboards for skateboards and stuff? I think that'd be really neat, don't you think? Like to go to work, you just like hop on like a hoverboard and, and stuff. I think that could be awesome. We should do it! I wish they were here now. I'd like have a hundred million of them and just like play. In fact, you could stack them and like make them really long and then you could just lie on it and you'd just be like sleeping like sleeping hoverboarding how fun would that be like hey 
I'm just chilling here, man. You look really cool. I think that look awesome. Look how quick my pumpkins are growing. Look at and look, there's a melon already grown behind me on my other road. That is fabulous. Such fabulousness. Awesome. Okay, so we're nearly done. This took a little bit longer than I thought, but then so did my intro and my hellos, all my animals. That always takes forever more. I can't quite even. So what we're going to do, as soon as I've got all these melons, have I got enough space? Oh yeah, of course. Uh, we're going to go and sleep in the Garden of Peace and Love, and then we're going to go over to the horsey stable, and we're going to get our first ever baby horse. So that's going to be so exciting. So exciting! I can't quite even on the excitement. The excitement levels are intense right now. Uh, right, so, um, oh look, uh, <laughs> this makes me sad. Do I have any seeds? I do now. Okay, let's just plant this real quick. Planty, planty. Right, okay, Max, we're going to go sleep, and we're going to go to the Garden of Peace and Love. So, you ready? You ready? Let's do this. Run, 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 run. Don't die now, don't perish. Hi, Shadow Pig, that's always there, and I don't know why. I can't even. Right, okay. Come on, Max. Come on, boy. Loves it. Max, you know what? You're my first ever doggy ever. Did you know that in Minecraft? Like, my first ever doggy in my land of love. Uh, where's Peace Pig? Peace Pig! Hi, Peace Pig! How are you doing, sir? Do you love life? Is life wonderful? Have a lovely jubbly. Is Peace Chicken... Oh, criminy! <laughs> Calm down, Amy. Where's Peace Chicken? Oh, he's over here. Right, I think I'm gonna sleep in the hammock this night. I was gonna say this morning, but it's night. So yeah, I'm gonna sleep up here. Yeah, loves it. Good night, everyone. Peace Pig, Peace Chicken, Max, and everyone else in my wonderful world. Loves it. And Guten Morgen. Can't quite even on the Guten. Right, so let's go ahead and get some gold. Now we have our cat. Ah! You scared me, sir! You scared me! You just sitting there like a gooseberry. Right, Katniss, we're on this. Max, stay away! Katniss has this. Max, don't get too close to him. Oh, Max, you're such a good dog. I love you. But yeah, so we now have our uh, carrots, so we just need to get some gold, and we can make some golden nuggets to surround the carrots, and then we can breed our ponies. Ah! The I Hate Amy Club president! Back away! Back away! Did you know there's an I Hate Amy 33 club and it's run by spiders? It's scary. It's a scary world anyway the gold should be hiding up in here do we have any we do look at that that's not gold amy that's a golden chest plate okay so if we put like a carrot let's do a few carrots just in case it doesn't work and as you know what we're gonna need to make the nuggets first so let's make that many nuggets and we're gonna surround the nuggets well we're gonna surround the carrots with nuggets so if we take a whole bunch of those we've got three do you think that should be enough should we make one more for good luck? Just one more. We're gonna need to like make a few more. There we go, loves it. And then we're gonna go around like this. Ah, there we go, perfect. Amy's creepy voice, it's legendary. Okay, awesome. So now we're gonna go down to our horsey stable. Horsey stable, we're gonna see Journey and Tinkerbell and Gabriel. And I do believe that Tinkerbell and Journey want to have a little baby because they're so super cute. I can't even. What color do you reckon the pony is gonna be? I wonder, it could be like, well, Tinkerbell is white and Journey is like a bay colour, so I wonder what colour it could be. I'm quite excited that I'm just like inside, I'm just like, oh my god, oh my god. Right, so ponies, ponies, look at, are you ready to have a baby? Tinks, have a lovely carrot. Journey, they're gonna have a pony, they're gonna have a little tiny, little, 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 Oh, look! Look at the Eleculus! The cuteness is so real! I cannot even... Is it a girl or is it a boy? Let me just check. It's a girl! It's a girl! We have a girl pony! Oh, I love her! She's the cutest little thing! Look how adorable. Have a lovely chubby. Now, what do we call this pony? I'm going to need you guys to come up with a really cool name for this pony. Write it in the comments down below. And whoever, like, whatever name I pick, you guys will end up in the cute red crew patch. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Thank you again to Ocean Girl 10 for your awesome picture. Check out the very end of this video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and if you liked this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys. I love ya. Bye!